This is going to be a test for this JMU team, and you may look at the stats and the numbers. An 0-2 main team who have some weapons at wide receiver. They have some weapons at running back. And this is going to be the first, as you said, the first test of what we're going to see through the CAA, gauging what the rest of the year could look like for this Duke's team. Everybody knows in, in this conference there are no easy wins at all, especially on the road. Uh, and so to be able to come here and get the victory today is, is, I think, a significant achievement for our group. Off the right side, gets across the goal line, touchdown. JMU, Reed goes in motion, handoff, stuffed Simeon Robinson there. Sure, looking to pass, fires across the middle, and it's caught by John Miller. What a miraculous catch amongst three defenders, makes the catch. And, you know, we really had a lot of adversity there you know, all the way through the first half into halftime and, and really maybe kind of started to get the momentum swing our way there in the second half with the, you know, the pick and the touchdown. Collins takes a snap. Pressure coming on first down as he rolls back to his left to pass, fires deep down the field, and it's intercepted by Jordan Brown at the seven-yard line. Give to Khalid Abdullah, trying to get outside, and does so Abdullah across the 25, across the 30. He is at midfield and still running. Turns to the inside, and they're not going to catch Khalid Abdullah, taking it to the house. I think that each week we just try to come out here and get better. Um, I think that we have have kind of put the nation on notice that we have a, a, a at least a decent backfield. So I think that every time we get on the field, we just want to try to outdo ourselves and outdo what we did the last week, the week before. going to catch him, Carden Johnson, with a 52-yard touchdown run. As the time as time goes on, and you know, in the game, everybody wears down. But it's it's about determination, and that's you know that was the key determination. So I think that's the main reason why you know, those big plays happen. The defense trying to make adjustments. Collins in the shotgun, looking to pass. Pressure coming. Hit as he throws ball hanging in the air, and it's intercepted at the 40-yard line. That's Rashad Robinson. He and off Williams hit hard and stuffed as soon as he really got to the line of scrimmage. Well, it's probably it's probably the difference in the ball game. You know, being able to uh, force the turnovers obviously is a big momentum boost for us. But then you'll know, be able to capitalize on it's what you hope to do. You know, any any time you you gain a possession, steal a possession from the opponents to make it, you know, turn it into something as far as points on the board. So I thought that was critical and probably the difference in the ball game. The main focus was to get them off the field. You know, it was getting down to the wire, and the team, you know, the defense came together, to get them off the field. That was my main focus as well. So. I did everything in my power to do that, and that's why that happened. Carter Johnson who leaves the game. Khalid Abdullah, play action to Khalid. Brian Shorter pass, fires out pass. Ravenel makes the catch, stays in bounds. What a great catch. Tremendous catch at the 29-yard line with a defender draped all over him. Yeah, I'm proud of our kids. I'm proud of the way they stuck together. I'm proud of the way they uh, they played together today and the way they fought. And uh, and just uh, I think it's just an excellent job by them getting the win. So the Dukes come north in an impressive second half. For JMU, they yield one touchdown, and they put up 21 points to get the 31-20 to win.